Hey everyone, this is My Alcohol Free Life Channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. My name is Terry G. Thanks a lot for stopping by. If you could take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel? Take another second and hit that like button. I'd really appreciate it. If you've come to my channel for the first time, what we do here is we talk about staying sober from alcohol one day at a time. I've been sober for a couple of decades and I share my experience, strength and hope with people who are thinking about sobering up or people who are sobering up one day at a time and having difficulties. I hope you can find some support here and I hope maybe I can convince you, at least to stay sober for a little bit, to give yourself an opportunity what it's like to be sober and what it's like to be released from the lash of alcoholism. That's what we do here. We give people hope, we give them strength and miracles are performed out there when you stop drinking. You can have a great life, you really, really can. That's what this channel is all about. What I wanna to talk to you about today though, I wanna move forward a little bit. I wanna talk about why was Alcoholics Anonymous so great for me? Why did AA work for me? I was a hopeless, just to start off a little bit, I was a hopeless alcoholic. I come from a really bad background. I had low self-esteem. I was drinking all the time towards the end of my drinking. I was having blackouts. I was having, I had criminal charges. I it was charged with assault. I ended up in jail. I was having a really bad life under the lash of alcoholism. A friend of mine who was a girl at that time, a girlfriend of mine told me, Terry, gee, you have a drinking problem. Maybe you should go to AA. And you know something? For some reason, the light came on and I said, you know something, Katie? Maybe I should go to AA. And I went there. And Alcoholics Anonymous has done a world of good for me. It really, really has. And I'm not promoting AA. I'm not promoting Alcoholics Anonymous. It doesn't have the market cornered on silvering up people. But it really does work. It really does work. The first thing I want to ask you, though, before I move a little forward, move forward with this, is that just keep an open mind, okay? This is my view of AA. This is the way I interpret it and what it's done for me, okay? It might not be the same for other people. I know there's a lot of negativity when it comes around people talking about AA, they think it's a cult, it's too spiritual, it's too religious. There's a lot of negativity with it, but also Alcoholics Anonymous has a very high success rate. It really does. And don't take my word for it, investigate it on the internet. It really has a high success rate and it's one of the largest pro programs out there to help people help themselves when it comes to their alcoholism one day at a time. It really, really works. For So number one, what, does it, what did it do for me that made me want to quit drinking and get my life in order? Well, my first meeting of Alcoholics Anonymous, I remember going in, it was about 150 people, believe it or not. It was called Tuesday Friday Group here in Ottawa. And I remember walking in and sitting down, I was very, very nervous. And one of the things I really enjoyed about that meeting was how friendly the people were. Automatically, I walked into this room and I was getting support from other people. I didn't have to do anything. I was afraid, I didn't have to shake anybody's hand, but automatically, I was getting support from other people. They didn't know me, they were very supportive, even that it was my very first meeting. They talked to me, so I felt very welcome there and I felt like I, like I was home, to be honest with you. Like, I felt like crap of myself, but the people in Alcoholics Anonymous at that time were very supportive to me. And that support followed through for many years. And I still go to meetings and that support is still there. If I have problems with my life on a daily basis, I could call like-minded people up in the program. I have friends now that support me. So one of the big things for me is the support that I've gotten from other people in Alcoholics Anonymous throughout the years. And it's helped me maintain my sobriety for many years. So support is number one. That's one thing that really worked for me. Another thing that it did for me, that it, it, it gave me hope. It gave me hope. The people and the program itself gave me hope in my life. When I came in to AA, my life was ruined. I was defeated, I was depleted, I was emotional, I was mentally, spiritually, physically bankrupt. I really was and I heard people in the program talk and people shared their stories with me and it gave me hope that maybe I could be sober, 
that maybe I could do what they do. And they wouldn't judge me. I didn't feel like I was being judged, but they gave me hope. They said, yeah, Terry, I can identify with you. I understand what's going on. Just come back tomorrow. We'll be here tomorrow. So that support that, that, support that they gave me, gave me hope. It always gave me hope and it gives me hope to this day. It doesn't matter what happens to me in my life, long as I stay connected to Alcoholics Anonymous and the group and the people in it, there'll always be hope for me. There'll always be a solution to my problem. Another thing I liked about Alcoholics Anonymous was the steps. The steps taught me through the steps, I don't want to get into the steps in detail. I could get into them in detail, but I don't want to because it would take too long this video. The steps really helped me deal with myself. I had no relationship with myself or higher power or spirituality. And through the steps, I became to know myself better. I really did. You know, step one, honesty. Step two, open-mindedness, willingness. Step four, cleaning house telling someone else about my problems, my defects, my issues in life in the step five, the harms that I did to other people, those kind of things. It helped me get rid of the guilt. It gave me a mechanism that I could get rid of this emotional baggage that I was carrying with me through my drinking career and through my childhood. It gave me a way out of that. And I really like that. I really love that because I didn't know what to do with my emotions, my guilt, my shame, my anger, my hurt, my jealousy, my envy. I didn't know what to do with all that stuff because I was very warped when I came in the program. But through the steps, I was able to learn how to deal with those emotions, how to get rid of them, understand that, and feel okay doing it. And also doing a step eight, a step nine, how to make those amends, how to go back to those people that I felt bad about things I did or, you know, said to them or whatever it may be and how to fix that solution, how to fix that problem. I really love that about AA. And also it gave me a way to reintegrate back into society through step 12, working with other people, you know, finding a sponsee, talking to them about the program, letting them know that I'm there for them. You know, it built my relationships with other people. And that's another thing Alcoholics Anonymous has done for me. It's enabled me to build relationships with others. And the first relationship I had to build is the one with myself. Improve my relationship with myself. And when I was able to do that through the steps and through having a higher power, I was able to build better relationships outside of me. Girlfriends, wives, brothers, sisters, fathers, mothers because I was able to do that. The steps gave me the opportunity to reintegrate back into society because when I drank, I was right out to lunch. I was not a part of the world, I wasn't. I was a part of the alcoholism world. It helped me do that. It gave me, it gave me the tools to be a human being, a decent human being because alcoholism, the act of alcoholism took away so much from me it took away tons for me. So the steps really helped a lot. There's another thing that helps me a lot in Alcoholics Anonymous that I do today, and that is called service work, helping other people. I've been a GSR, I've been worked at the intergroup, I did a, the, um, the grapevine, I did a lot of positions in our area as service work and carrying the message to the alcoholic that still suffers. And because I was able to do service work and people let me do that and help me do that, it boosted my self-esteem. It really did. I thought I couldn't read and write and I didn't think I could talk in front of people and do all these cool things that we did in service, talk to doctors and talk to professionals and things like that. I'm just an alcoholic, I'm a bus driver. Here's me talking to all these people who are well-educated and it enabled me to do that. Because I was able to do that through the program, it boosted my self-esteem, it boosted my self-worth. So helping others is an intricate part of recovery and we always do that each and every day. We reach out to an alcoholic that's still suffering and we help them. And that suffering alcoholic doesn't necessarily mean to be a newcomer. It can be somebody else, a friend, somebody with many years of sobriety, but they can reach, we can reach out and talk to them 
and help them out. So that really helped me a lot. It really did. But the biggest thing, the biggest thing that Alcoholics Anonymous has done for me, okay, the biggest thing, it's enabled me to stay sober for just about 30 years of my life. It's enabled me to do that. I've been divorced. I've had loss of business. I've I have all those life things, death, children born, all those things in life, cars, new cars, cars break down, whatever it may be, life was moving forward one day at a time and I lived it sober for the last 30 years without taking a drink. And if you don't believe that, that Alcoholics Anonymous works, it really does. It really does. This video is just very general, but this support that I talked about, this hope that I talked about, the steps that I talk about, the service that I talked about is an intricate part of my sobriety. I've stayed sober for a very long time. You know, half my life, I'm 60 years old and it's half my life I've been sober. You know, I always say I've had two lives and I really have, I really have. And another thing that Alcoholics Anonymous has helped me out in my life and why I think it's such a great problem program because it's helped me come in contact with a higher power. I choose to call that higher power God, that spirituality part of the program. It's really helped me do that. And I've gained that through working the steps and working with others and praying and talking to like-minded people in 12-step programs. That's really helped me along and guided me when it's come to my spirituality. So there are the, basically the things that, I, that really helped me it's in AA. And another, another thing, I'll just hold you, I'll just hold you for one more minute. Another thing that really helped me is the knowledge base in Alcoholics Anonymous. You know, if you have a problem with your car, if you have a problem with things, people can give you really some sound advice on how to do things. There's so many people, so much knowledge in Alcoholics Anonymous outside of the program that they can help you out. They can help you out too. That's another thing I wanted to tell you. Like I just throw that in. And another one is sponsorship. I have a sponsor for 30 years, the same gentleman. We're friends. It's helped me with my relationships, interpersonal skills. So there's a lot of things that has helped me and in, in sobriety. And another one is that because I was sober, I was able to look at all those really bad things or traumatic things that happened to me in my childhood. Because I was sober, I was able to help myself get better emotionally and deal with those those traumatic events that happened to me in my teens in my early childhood years it, that's another thing that's helped me i could go on and on of the things that alcoholics anonymous has done for me as an individual i, I really can i can go on and on about it but like i said if you're going to go to the program if you're going to go there just keep an open mind just keep an open mind no one is asking you or they didn't ask me to do anything they just said to me you know terry just come just come next week don't worry about anything just come and stay sober one day at a time and we'll help you do that we'll help you do that and to this day they're continuing to help me stay sober one day at a time so is aa good for me a is fantastic for me is it good for you you'll have to decide on your own but give it an opportunity give it 30 days give it 60 days let it sink in a little bit see how it goes for you don't give up so easy don't judge other people keep an open mind give it time it will work for you the same way it worked for terry g it really will okay my life ain't perfect but you know something i can do sobriety one day at a time i know that i have support i have hope I have the steps, I have the traditions, I have spirituality, I have friends in the program, I have a sponsor, I have all these things working for me on my side of my, 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 my side of sobriety. You know, what the world could throw at me, the support behind me is more likely greater than what the world could throw at me because I will not will not i don't want to drink ever again i will always reach out i will always use the tools of alcoholics anonymous given to me to stay sober one day at a time okay 
So that's it folks, that's just a little video about why AA worked for me. And I could go on and on, but I don't want to go on and on because they're the main things, okay? They're the main things. So I just want to say thank you very much for stopping by and watching my video. If you could take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel? Can you take another second and smash that like button? I'd really appreciate it, okay? My name is Terry G. This is my Alcohol Free Life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. Give the program a chance. Give yourself an opportunity to get sober one day at a time, okay? Give yourself that opportunity, okay? Like I said, my name's Terry G. Ciao for now. If you could take a second, subscribe. I probably already said that. And remember, stay safe, stay sober. God bless. Together, we can get sobriety. Together, we can do it, okay? No one is an island. Ciao for now.